Nicola, welcome. It is nice to have you. If you are new to this channel, welcome. Okay, so we're gonna get right into it talking about blow dryers. So today we're gonna to take a look at two different kinds and um, the first one is by Belisa and it's their blow dryer brush and this is what it looks like. These guys come in different colors. Okay, there isn't much on the box itself. The box is, you know, pretty huge. Uh, it goes up to 1200 watt of drying. It has um, different settings, uh, three different settings, including a cool setting. Um, so, if you're not familiar with, with a brush, I just put my hand so you see how big this is. This is a spiral brush. So when you go, you just kind of, you know, however you want to twist it to help dry your hair. Um, the bristles were really nice when I tried this. It glides through my hair really well. I did try to blow dry my hair when it was fully wet. With this, I didn't have a problem with tangles or anything. The brush is really nice, no snags, nothing like that. As you can see, it's pretty much aerodynamic. It's big down here. So I'm thinking most of the fan power is probably in here or the motor. And then the hand portion that you hold is pretty small, so it's not too bad, all right? It does go in a little bit, so you can actually really grasp it really well. This portion of it is, I find to be really big. Um, yeah, but this dryer didn't get hot enough for me. Um, I'm not sure if it's maybe faulty with this particular one that I'm holding, or it's just all of them all around. But for that reason, I didn't like this one to blow out my 4B four, four hair too much. Yeah, so um, if I had to choose between this one and this Revlon that we're gonna look at next, they're definitely the Revlon. So this is the Revlon, this is what it looks like. This is their brush, okay? It's more like those flat brushes that you use to do a wrap. I used one of these when my uh, hair was relaxed. Except these, of course, it's a dryer, so there's holes here. But as you can see, it's also pretty soft. Okay, down here is the bigger portion, and I think it has all your motors and your fan in here. Because in here, I don't see anything at all. It's just the holes where the heat come out. It slims right here, so you can hold it really well. As you can see, um, it's fairly big, but I do like it a lot. It feels not not as bulky as as the previous one. So I like the way it feels better. What I like about this, this guy heats a lot better. So I blew out my hair with it, as you can see, <laughs> right? But my hair with this wasn't fully wet. It was damp, just so you know um, what I actually did. I did put some heat protectant on it and I blew it out. And yeah, I like this, I like this a lot. This actual uh, uh, blow dryer gets really, really hot. I'm sure it probably um, boasts a 12, a 12 watt as, as well. Oh gosh, there isn't much information on the box, but uh, okay, it's, uh, it's a 120 volt, but it's not telling me how, how, how hot it gets. I guess I would have to read the instruction booklet, but I'm pretty sure it's similar to the other. But you can actually feel the heat on this guy. Same thing also, it has three settings. One's a cool setting. Down here, you kind of switch the switch to the sides, you know. Um, the other one works exactly the same way, you know, same thing. But this one, yeah, just because this one heats a lot better, and I think it just works a lot better, I can manage it a lot better. It's not as heavy as this guy. So yeah, I definitely like this one. It works nicely on my 4B hair, so I'm thinking it works great on all four type hair. If you just want a, a reasonable price blow dry, I think I paid like $27 dollars for this, roughly $30. And if you don't want to spend a lot of money on a $400 <laughs> Dyson or a Rev Air, you know, this is actually a pretty good option. About the drying time, it was really, really fast because it's a brush. It's separating the hair and the heat has a chance to actually like go through the hair, you know, so it's, you find that drying time is not bad at all. Really, really fast. Okay, and just by comparison, this is what they look like. As you can see, this one's a lot more bulky. Yeah, so this one doesn't get as hot and it doesn't, it's not as aerodynamic as this guy. It's not as sleek, not as manageability of it. This one's much better, okay? As you can see what that looks like, you know? Yeah, so yeah, I would definitely recommend this for anybody who's looking for a decent blow dryer, a brush blow dryer. Again, this one's by Revlon. 
very nice price is reasonable love it love it love it all right guys so go out and try your new blow dryer <laughs> get one try it and leave a comment let me know how you like it I'm actually in love with this one I like it a whole lot all right I love you guys it's Nicola and I'm out ciao have a blessed day